Few U.S. presidents so early in their first term have had the opportunity to leave their mark on their country like Donald Trump does. The Supreme Court is the final judge in all cases involving laws made by Congress. So those who are appointed matter. Please raise your right hand. Donald Trump's first nominee, a conservative judge, Neil Gorsuch, was confirmed last year. Justice Gorsuch, we hit a home run there and we're going to hit a home run here. And uh, step by step, we are making America great again. Trump interviewed at least seven candidates to replace retiring Justice Anthony Kennedy. His announcement is expected to kick off a contentious nomination process. President Trump has proven that he wants the best of the best on the Supreme Court. He Conservative groups have launched an offensive to shift the nine-member court to the political right. This video is just part of that multi-million dollar lobbying effort. But Democrats are spending too, determined to block Republican efforts. I don't like judges who want to make law rather than interpret law, so I don't like judges too far right, and I really don't like judges too far left either. If confirmed by the U.S. Senate, the incoming judge has the potential to remake the ideological balance of the Supreme Court, potentially overturning precedent-setting decisions on health care, gay marriage, and even the landmark 1973 ruling, which legalized abortion in the United States. Keep families together. That's why grassroots groups on both sides are mobilizing to influence the confirmation. What we have is the American people on our side. If you look at the poll numbers, if you ask people what they want out of a jurist, what they want out of the Supreme Court, it is not the kind of people who Donald Trump has on his short list. Democrats are pushing to delay the confirmation vote on Donald Trump's Supreme Court nominee until after November congressional elections. Republicans made the same argument back in 2016 and successfully blocked Barack Obama's third appointment to the Supreme Court. Their argument now blowing back that Americans should have the opportunity to weigh in on a justice with the potential to influence the Supreme Court for at least a generation. Kimberly Helkett, Al Jazeera, Washington.